magnificent fun we had last night, wasn't it? All tied up underneath the bridge. Nowhere to blow, I mean go. Oh, what's with all the cans? Well, as you can see here, I'm having a beer. Big old beer. Wait. Ever seen a beer can this big before? Well, I kind of wanted the can. Well, the contents are good sometimes. I don't know. Beer's getting pretty bad these days. All these knockoff drinks and beer that's flavored, whatever. Anyway. Yeah, but uh, as you can see, I got a little collection of cans going on down here. and uh, They're the larger ones, and I need to have a... I need to make a fire tin and a stove. So we're going to make a couple of little items from these cans that I have, you know, now that I have material and the contents in me. So I get kind of bored when I'm drinking and I want something to do. we got some changes going on here at Camp Glendleton. You know, the gnomes are getting restless. And, uh, so we're having to change up our moda operandi here. There's going to be a few things going on, and uh, I acquired some uh, more bike parts so I can actually repair the, uh, finish putting together the uh, the actual touring bike that I got that was locked to a parking meter in front of a church for two years. And uh, they gave it to me, but the condition was that I had to get it off the lock. So I had to go and uh, commandeer my friend One-Armed Charlie. I had to get his bolt cutters, and we cut the, we cut the uh, bike off the parking meter. But it was stripped, and pretty much nothing but the frame and the controllers, and the, yeah, you know, so, but I, it's actually what I need to accomplish my mission. So now we have more bike parts, we can put it together. So like I said, I got a few things I got to do this week, and uh, hopefully the weather won't interfere with that or drinking too much beer. Yeah. Cheers. Here's to you. So stay tuned. Get you a beer. Pull up, you know. Post up, whatever you call it. But yeah, we're going to take some of these cans and we're going to do some other stuff with them other than recycle them and try to get some money. Yeah, we're going to make a few things out of them. A stove, a fire tent. Um, maybe I might make a couple extra, you know, and give them away. I don't know. But the weather's been pretty decent lately, other than the occasional, you know, 3 o'clock in the morning, let's go hide under the bridge thing. And uh, we're fixing to have to take the camp on down the road. We've been here too long. It's starting to get boring. I've already told too many people where I live. I think three, four. Yeah. They don't come by very much. It's too far out of town and it's not close enough to the beer store for them. Plus I'm probably pretty boring or I work too much or whatever. You know, they get mad at me for getting $20 bills at 11 o'clock at night at the gas station because I changed somebody's tire. I mean, yeah, that can be pretty humiliating, you know, being a man of many skills and talents. But uh, I'm Glenn Monroe, the Roman gnome, of course, and uh, yeah, we're here at Camp Glendleton, and we got some things to do this week, so I hope you uh, stay tuned, check out some of the things that's going to go on, and uh, maybe you might learn a few things. Hey, maybe you can teach me a few things. I like learning. I don't really like buying stuff. I like to save my money for beer, but uh, yeah, I went and checked out a few things. I've been watching some of these other, I guess when you call them survival videos or whatever, you know, when the stuff hits the fan or bush, bush crafting. 
preppy for emergencies or what do you do when you're living in the wild like me for the last four years now? Hey, maybe it's already hit the fan for some of us already. So I don't know about you people at home. If you're watching this, apparently you have the ability to, you know, still make do. If you got one of them smartphones, a smartphone. So if you have a smartphone, does that mean you're smart now? I don't know, man. Most of the people I see with those things, they usually walk right across the street and get hit by a car. Or they're too busy trying to drive while they're twiddling their thumbs. I don't know. But, yeah, we got a couple projects coming up. You know, especially with our favorite beer cans here. So, stick around. Check them out. Got a couple projects coming up. I'll see you later. Alright? Don't drink too much. Ugh.